Welcome to Conan Exiles, the Nasty Zombie Clan. We are here <laughs> in our little um, house. Not not super big yet, but we have plans. Or Zombie has plans. I don't know. He's he's kind of doing the construction part. And I don't really care at this point about all that. Um, oh, and Zombie, I was thinking, look, I gathered yep. a bunch of materials and made a bunch of pieces that you can use to build. But... Um, I was thinking, like, this is a, a nice starting spot because it's safe. It's the availability of various different resources. It's super close to us. But uh, we don't have to live here. I mean, this can just be a starter base for us. And then we can pick up this equipment and take it with us wherever we want to go. Well, yeah, that's it, one thing. Or we, could also we can just leave it. This base here. And make more, yeah. Make outposts the further we go. Because I'd imagine we'll have to come down here for something eventually. Potentially, Wait, sure. Probably. Now, it's not a bad idea um, to have a place like this where we can hang, and it's a safe zone, we can have a bunch of availability of resources and things like that, and then we just make outposts elsewhere. So, uh, it's up to you. Yeah. If, if as we adventure around, you find a spot that you like better, hey, by all means, we just build there. Not a big deal. Well, that that's what I'm thinking. We, like... Because there's some thralls just below us, mm -hmm. we go hire those as our friends, whether they like it or not. Yeah. And then after that, we move on to the next area and so on, basically, until we get to a point where we have bases scattered around and we can just go to each one to make stuff or get stuff or whatever. Hey, I'm game if for whatever. Sense. This world is big and there's a lot to it, but if we yeah. want thralls, that means we need a wheel of pain. And if we want a wheel of pain, yes. that means we need to get a bunch of other stuff going too. So there are a variety of things. Now, yep. I, because I gathered and did crap while you were offline, I've got levels on you, and that gives me the capability of having already learned some feats that open up things yep. like... The alchemist bench, the carpenter's bench, the uh, well, we've already got the blacksmith's bench, but and the artisan table, but we need an armorer's bench, a casting table. Uh, wouldn't be a bad idea to you know get a bunch of these other things, a fireball cauldron, and all kinds of things going. Um, now I had been Sounds temporarily good. placing crap outside until we get a base big enough, and. Then we can put it inside and not have to stand. Oh, look at this. Look at what you're doing. How cool. Nice. Oh, I did a bunch of triangular pieces. If you choose to do things like that, yeah. we can make, you know, all kinds of goodies, you know, different different ways to do it. So. Yeah, I'm making use of what we've got or what you've made. Um, but, yeah, there we go. Some more building. Um, nice to have a hidey hole dotted around the map. Yes, that sounds about what I'm doing. Like little bases around the map. And hello, Henry. Hi, Henry. Uh, it's four, degree four degrees for Henry where he is. Good mm, grief. Chilly. Like it's that. about... The it's not much warmer here. Um, it is... Uh, it's not showing me at the moment. It's about two degrees. It's, it's not got above two degrees most of this week for England, where I am, which is horrible. I don't like it. It's too cold. Oh, look, dude. Ever since the latest patch, which was a major yeah. update, I don't know, 500 megs or something, it was big. Yeah. Um, this camp right down here, no thralls. Yeah. No people in it. Oh, that sucks. I, I don't know why. I don't know why. Oh, oh, I should let you know also, look, I changed a few of the server settings. Um, when I was oh, gathering, yeah. I bumped up the harvesting level so that I wouldn't get a huge number of levels while I was gathering. Um, so And it would make the gathering quicker. Okay. Uh, but I set that back yeah. down not quite to 1, which is the default. I set it down to like 1.2 or 1.3 or something like that. So we'll gather a slight yeah, amount fine. more than normal. But the other thing I was thinking about is, look, because we're doing this uh, as a video and a stream... Um, we don't want our thrall production and our pet production to take forever. And it would be like four or no. five or six episodes or something before we actually get a thrall. So I bumped up, uh, well, I, I lowered the time it would take to tame up a thrall or a pet. 
not like to, fine. to the lowest setting, it's, but a, significantly lower than what it would normally take in game. So, but other than that, yeah, I haven't adjusted like EXP or anything like that. So, but I'm gonna run over no, while you're not a problem. Yeah, while you're doing some building things. Um, oh, I would recommend as you go start making some more of our things. Like for instance, we'll need for sure the carpenter's table, and for sure the tannery as soon as possible, and the fire bowl cauldron. Those. Okay. I can't remember the other ones, but I mean, we're going to need to get all of the stuff. But those for sure are yeah. going to be required for us, I think, to get to the point where we can start taming up thralls. So, but I'm going to run over to this other yeah. camp over here. And for my viewers on my video, I'll apologize. Ever since this recent update, my game hiccups like crazy. Like it stutters every few seconds, and it's driving me freaking bananas. And I was telling Zombie before we started the stream that um, I have changed my settings from ultra down to the absolute lowest quality on everything, and it nothing made a difference. Not nothing at all made any difference. So I'm not sure what's causing this, uh, but it's it's really irritating. But I'm just gonna get through it. So that's my story. <laughs> Yeah, dude, I came over okay. to this camp, and I, w I just came and looted their little box, and that's it. There's no people. Is that the one below us? No, it's the one, um, it's kind of on a little archway thing across the river. It's the one on the same level as us. Okay. And then the one down below us, I'm not sure. I, I do know, well, well, let me double check before I say I know. But I'm almost positive that that uh, named person spawn is still active down here somewhere. Yeah, yeah. The named guys that we had gotten some armor from, they're still wandering around yeah. over there. So, I mean, potentially we could get the named guys and thrall them up. But they're a lot harder <laughs> because, you know, they're a little bit harder. But yeah. We could do it together. I think we could do it together. No, the name one. I was kind of hoping we get some name ones from this one, and then we can just take them with us to the next place if we needed it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, I'm getting video. Yeah, it, it's my video is fine. I'm I'm not getting tr any kind of lag at my end, Rook. So, but I've only literally just loaded up the game, and I had to verify some corrupted files, mm. which was rather annoying. Hence, why I'm a little bit late tonight. So. I've already said to um, Rook that it's pros probably just the uh, drivers that's the problem. Yeah, possibly. I'll, I'll have to update my my Nvidia video driver. But yeah, but that's the one thing I haven't done. I made I made registry changes and all kinds of stuff to get my um, yeah. You know, Windows Defender runs you know a pretty hefty memory intensive um, executable in the background all the time so I you know I made registry changes to stop that so I could at least eliminate that as a culprit and I mean I messed with all kinds of settings in game and out and I just it doesn't matter uh, no matter what I've done I still have this weird hiccup so but yeah. whatever I'll deal with it it happens um, right are we going anywhere specifically? Well, I'll tell you what. If today. we, I would say we need to get a fireball cauldron, some brimstone, and um, what? Oh, and tar. But the and that way we could start steel production because with these forges or these uh, furnaces, I've been cooking up a bunch. Oh, what's happened? Is this? Oh, it's turned off. We need to turn these on. Oh, it's out of metal. Really? I ran out of metal already? That's crazy. I got a bunch of it. Yeah, well, it's all cooked up. Uh, we'll need to get more metal, I think. You, you never have too much metal. So. Um, you but, got a couple um, of spare flawless medium harnesses, then. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I think I killed that guy, like, twice um, down there. I got myself a hat, and I got you a hat. And there might be even some other, I don't know, there's a, a skirt that you could wear too, or whatever it's called. I don't know. I'm good. I am so good. 
Uh, where and are you putting iron bars? Randomly got five on me. In the furnaces, there's a ton. I made oh, yeah. one furnace, I made a bunch of bricks, and then... The Holy two crap. Yeah, the other two furnaces I made... Oh, oh, I made you pick. I made you a, a pick, if you didn't notice. There's a metal pick around here somewhere. Yeah. And I, it might be in the blacksmith um, build, uh, thing. Check in there. I made some metal uh, tools ooh, for there's us. Iron cleaver, iron skinning knife. Yeah. I'll take the metal pick. Now, I can't. If you don't know, the skinning knife, of course, gets you more skins when you kill animals. And that's going to be important when we start processing the hides because you get tar from the hides. And you have to process the hides yeah. in the tannery in order to do that. Okay. So you need to get that going. And you need the tar in the fireball cauldron with brimstone in order to make this stuff called steel fire, I think it's called. And that then you combine okay. in the furnace with the iron, and that will then make steel. Okay. It's Sounds a, good. It's yeah. a process, but I know where to get brimstone. And if you want to make those, I, I've been hesitant to make any more of the stuff because you could get more EXP from that and, and catch up. Okay. Sounds good. Um. Yeah, I've got, I'm making some iron weapons for myself. Okay. And a hatchet and an axe. Ooh, I think I made level. you Look stuff. Yeah, no, there's an iron hatchet yeah. here. There's an iron axe. You got a cleaver. You made a cleaver. Um, yeah, and the skinny... Oh, and the cleaver, that's for use to, like, in butchering. If, like, oh, let's say you kill a shaleback, right? One of the turtle monsters. If you want yeah. to get more savory flesh from them, use the cleaver to harvest them. Okay. If you want to get more hide, use the skinning knife instead. Yeah. Now, either one of those tools Fair will enough. give you both hides and meat, but the proportion changes depending on the tool. Okay. Sounds good. I'm just literally dropping some random stuff off, and then we can head off if you want. Well, I would say let's, if you would like, let's build some of the necessary things. A tannery, a fireball cauldron, and a carpenter's bench. Because we're going to need um, shaped wood as well. If we're going to do um, a wheel of pain, we got to have that stuff. Now, we, I think we could actually okay. make the, the little wheel of pain. Which well, I learned that last time. Did you? I, it only takes one uh, thrall at a time, though. The next one up, the regular yeah, wheel fine. of pain, you could put four of them in there at a time. Yeah, I can make the wheel of fr um, pain. The, sorry, sorry, the thrall the, taker. The lesser, uh, lesser wheel of pain. Yeah. So where do we? It's handcrafted. Okay. Mm-hmm. Furniture maker? No, I don't care. Well, about we can that. do like two of those. It's, I mean, I can do one of those two. Oh, you know what? Let's take a look. Um, yeah, lesser wheel of pain feats. So, a regular wheel of pain. Where is that? The carpenter table. Did you want me to learn that? Yeah. Okay, that is learnt. Tannery. That is learnt. Um, and Henry says, NVIDIA had a big driver update earlier this week. Oh, wow. Okay. That might solve my problem. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. And uh, I want a star metal pickaxe. Uh, yeah, good luck with that. It'll be a long, long time, <laughs> my friend. Oh. Oh, yeah. Uh, Wheel of Pain, level 30. Yeah, the, the lesser wheel of pain, though. We yeah, can we, can both, now, we can both do that now. So what? Oh, crap. <laughs> Rocks are falling off the sky. Uh, right, primitive cook. Why can I not learn that? I need to learn the campfire? Why is it not letting me... Uh, why is it being annoying? Campfire, it's not letting me... Okay, so I know the 
Try complete sentences. I might be able to help. Yeah, the primitive. I want the um, improved campfire, but I can't get the improved campfire because it's saying I don't have the primitive cook. It just said that is the. It just says primitive cook. Yeah, right? well, click that's on all, that's not a click on the primitive cook where yeah, it shows it that. there, and then you have to learn that. Doing that and it's not doing anything. Well. So what am I? Am I just on? I might not be the. No, it's it's. Let me. Oh, there we go. Now it's doing it. Stupid yeah. Game. <laughs> um, how about mithril armor? Oh yeah. I wonder if mithril armor exists. Um, haven't no, seen it. Does, it, does it. it. There's a ton of different armors. A lot of them are dependent on having all these different expansions, though. But but here's a cool thing. If you get a good like a named. Um, blacksmith or armorer thrall they will teach you how to make all these different armors like a, a special cultural armor set or something very cool stuff so yeah Fair I'm enough. anxious to get some thralls going and some pets in fact we could do the pet thing uh, same time and get some pets going yeah I mean, they're not going to help us with crafting, but, you know. Oh, but they will provide hey, us with poop. Why is that one locked? And poop is a good thing. Why? I'm guessing... I'm not high enough level to learn the water well, but where does it say what level you need? Uh, level 25. Yeah, there on the right-hand side, it. just above. Uh, it'll tell you. There's so much. There is. Uh, right. Um, well, I'll tell you what. I want... I've learned a bunch of different sure. things already based on my level because I'm I'm a level twenty three already. Yeah. No nope. blood letter bows. You know what I'm gonna no, do? No, I can't. I'm gonna do something you can't do. Right now. Ooh. Uh, can I do that? Wood. Twine and hardened stone. steel yes. bow, hardened steel tools, ancient bow, razor arrows. I require steel tools. Okay, blunted arrows. Uh, blunted arrow for taking down enemies at range. How does that help us? Does that cause. Oh. Okay, let me let that me clue you in on blunted arrows and the blunted javelin. Um, if you want to knock a thrall out instead of yeah, killing them, I figured it. Yeah, you use blunted weaponry. Normally, you'll just go up and smack them with the um, truncheon. Yeah. Which you have to build a uh, torturer's table in order to get yeah. the truncheon. But um, you can also use blunted arrows, but. You also have a, to have a tinkerer's table and learn how to make the blunting thing. It's an attachment that then goes on your <laughs> bow. Because if you don't do that, you'll still end up killing it. Even if you've got blunt yeah. arrows, your bow will do too much damage. So, yeah, it's the whole thing. A lot of hard work, basically. Yeah. And the javelin works well, but it's one of those tools that, like a spear, if you right click it'll throw it and then you can't you can't retrieve it. it if you stick with the left click on the target then you can just smack them until they pass out but if you accidentally right click like to do a power attack bye bye javelin it just goes <laughs> <laughs> that's not good yeah and if it sticks into the enemy unlike in seven days to die you can't retrieve you know that that weapon from their body like it's sticking out of them like you can with the seven day oh, no. zombies yeah that's so when, not good yeah it's kind of messed up when you, you're thinking oh god i'm just gonna grab it out of him no nope, no nope, that's not gonna happen <laughs> uh, hello cherry and yes it's a new game conan exiles hi um, cherry i was just looking through all the hundreds of millions of things that i can learn and i <laughs> can't learn half of i can't even learn like 10 percent of it but yeah, it's because I'm too low level and I need to kill stuff. Um, also, I need to. Uh, right. Iron axe. I need. 
Okay, so uh, iron hatchets, aha, uh -huh. and then that. So the iron hatchet will allow me to chop down trees still, correct? Sure, and better, more more efficiently, you get more um, harvest That's from fine. them. So, yep. Awesome, so I've got all steel tools now. Dude, look at this. Um, Boom! Ha <laughs> ha! I have a place of worship for Mithra. Mit Mitra? Mitra. Mithra. Someone's been working too much. They've been cheating. So it's uh, you know, right. and you can place your uh, your you worship set, right? Yeah. All it takes is wood, twine, and stone, and we've got plenty of all of it. You could just make your place of worship, pop it. Next oh no, to sorry. Mine over here. Mine's mine's yog. Okay. And stone, wood, twine, and bone. Thirty bone. Yeah, we've got plenty of all that stuff. So let's take a look in here. Um, I'll take a thousand. I'm encumbered, of course. Now, mine is cool because if I go in here and look under consumables, I can make ambrosia. Ambrosia is like a regeneration Ooh. potion. Now, I would have I'm to... Oh, twine. I would have to, like, kill people and then smack them with a special weapon out of here, my Mithrian, Mit, Mitrian Onk. So I need iron and branches for that, which I'm going to do right now. Is that roasted beef? Oh, I'm so encumbered. <laughs> I've got a thousand stone and wood on me. I'm surprised I can even walk. All right. Do we have any bone? Somewhere. Um, yes. Um, so I need 30 bone and 12 twine. I know I had... Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, there's 12 bones in this box with all the rocks yeah. and wood. I found that. Um, Let's see if there's any twine in here. Heavy pelt, branch, twine. I found the twine. I just need bone now. Yep. I can still jump despite being encumbered. That's good to know. Yeah. Uh, that's brick. Nope. I don't take damage from standing on the furnace. That's good to know. Uh, Rook is going to harvest people. Kind of yuck. Yeah. <laughs> But it's um, part. It's I would say it's part of the game. It's it's not that you're harvesting them. It's um, well, how else to put it? You're well. Sometimes I have taking to, oh, their soul essence I, or something I like that. My, it? Yeah, yeah. I'm, their vital essence. I, I uh, siphon it off of their dead corpse. So not as bad as it okay. sounds, really. Yeah. You need more bone for need, your temple? I need bone. I need bone. You've made bone arrows. Swore. That's probably where all the bones... I know I had bones. Did I not put bones in one of these? Look, dude, there's 55 bones in the blacksmith bench. Well, why'd you hide them in there? That's I spread them around them. all over the place. Because I was just shoving them in. Your, your, your organizational skills suck. Well, dude... Compared to mine... Look, when you start going to make stuff I, in the various benches, you're going to need all the little supplies. And you're going to end up dragging, yeah. oh, i got to go grab this out of this and that out of that. And it's going to be annoying. So I just start shoving yeah, everything I like, into the crafting stations. I like the games that allow you to um, make a, uh, what, how do you put it? So where it sees all the crates... And if you go into a workbench, it will know what is in every single crate, and therefore you don't have to have it on your actual person. Uh, yeah. It will take it from those various crates. Ark, Ark had something like that. I don't know if it was based off of a mod or the, they implemented it. Yeah, it was a mod that game, allowed that. Yeah, I remember that. That, um, was, that was pretty good. But that's one of the best things ever, because then you don't have to worry about taking it there. Yep. You just go to that workbench, and the workbench takes it all out for you. Yeah, well, you don't have that Simple. in this game, so um, you might want to just consider not crying about it. I'm going to cry about <laughs> it. 
All right, so look, we can we can go and explore. And I, dude, I know of um, close to here. I know of a cave that has named people in addition to various different craftsmen and all kind. Oh, look at this! You just ah. built a big fire pit. What the hell? Pit of Yog. I am the god in the bowl, apparently. Oh, dude, uh, a you know, burning offering. A barbarian. That's what I see these things over at the at the weirdos camps. All the the freaky weirdo people have these. See, my, I'm civilized. Mine <laughs> well, can is make very, a very nice. Ooh, can I get thirty more bone and some? What was that? Uh, branches. Five branches and thirty bone. Where did I put the bone? Back in here. I'm gonna make myself a yog cleaver. Oh, good. Okay. Yeah, I've got my onk. Ah, where did the other bones? There we go. There's the other bones. Well, we can go get and... more bones now and stuff. But you know what? While we're thinking about all that stuff and you're you're boning your god, I will um say thank you so much, everyone, for joining. I hope you're enjoying this. If you are, smash the like button, do all the good stuff. Uh, leave us comments if you're watching my video. If not, you guys really should come over and watch the stream. And uh, we will talk with all of you again very, very soon. Bye.